So right now we're going to check in with Dr. Kayla Bechtold this morning. Good morning, Kayla. Good morning. I should say good morning, doctor. Wow. How are you? Good. Good. Uh, Dr. Kayla Bechtold of the Ralph Eye Care uh, Center, of course, joining us this morning. The best care for your eyes, ladies and gentlemen. And this time of the year, uh, year, year round, some people deal with this, but especially in the winter months, we were just talking about my whole body is dry. Skin, uh, inside, dehydrated, but um, we're going to talk dry eye. Explain yeah. a little bit about that. Uh, dry eye is, uh, technically they say it's about 15% of the population, but I think that's people who are really diagnosed with that. I think the numbers are actually quite a bit higher, judging by what we see in the office. Um, and symptoms of dry eye are your eyes feel dry, um, <laughs> gritty, red, you can get blurry vision, your eyes can be really watery. Uh, if your eyes get very dry, you'll reflex tear and they'll just water down your face, so it is a symptom. Um, before, you know, when we have patients come in, we just give them a bottle of tears and see them in a year and right. that's pretty much all we had. But they've been doing a lot more research on exactly what it comes from um, and on the tear film itself. So the tear film isn't just one solid entity, it has three layers. And the bottom layer is sticky and it sticks it on your eye. The middle layer is liquid, and that's made by your lacrimal gland. And then the top layer is oil, which is actually made by your eyelids. So if any one of the layers isn't working the way that it should, you will have dry eye. And a lot of times the symptoms feel the same regardless of which is bad. So it makes it difficult for us just with examining exactly what's going on. I mean, there are some things we can tell. Uh, but uh, Ralph Eye Care has become a, a tear lab uh, dry eye center. And so the, the tear lab is a machine that takes a small sample of the tear film and it can measure the layers and tell how inflammatory or salty your tears are. Wow. Yeah, and so it helps us to decide how to treat you. If we try to treat the aqueous layer in your oil layers, the problem is not going to help. Uh, and so we take this measurement, we have these numbers, and we can gear a treatment protocol to that. Uh, and then the other nice thing is that in about four to six weeks later, we can recheck it. And if our numbers are getting closer together and coming down that's what we want and so we know it's working because sometimes with dry eye you don't necessarily feel awesome after two days of treatment it takes a lot of time right so um, it's encouraging to see if our numbers are improving that our treatments working and if they're not then we change it so um, it's been really valuable and it's it's also been nice to so patients realize that we can't really cure it. We don't have a good pill or a shot or something like that. It is kind of a, a regimen. It's something that they have to keep up with. Um, and yeah, so we've had just much, much better luck treating dry eye with it. I, I, I would not like to have to treat dry eye again without the machine. It's been great. It sounds amazing. It really does. Uh, people want to find out more about the, uh, the dry eye or all the services you have going on at Ralph Eye Care with Dr. Kayla Bechtold and the rest of the staff. How can they do so? Uh, we have a website, RalphEyeCare.com. There's also RalphOptical.com and Facebook page with Ralph Eye Care Specialists and Ralph Optical. And uh, you can give us a call also, 720-3553. Beautiful. Dr. Kayla Bechtold, Ralph Eye Care, the best eye care. Uh, the best care for your eye, I should say. And we want to thank you so much for coming in this morning with that uh, wonderful information. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's 725. Uh, we're gonna